The Texas women's hoops team had its media day Tuesday. There are lofty expectations for this team as the Big 12 coaches voted the Horns to win the league. Texas was 22-12 last year, dominating at home with a 14-2 record. UT's third place finish in the Big 12 was the highest in the league since 2005. I caught up with some confident Horns earlier. Practices have been super competitive with our guards. Like, we have a lot of guards, clearly. And so, I mean, every day you have to bring it on the floor. You have to be mentally there coming into practice. So just the whole preparation coming into practice has made things like a lot more competitive having so many guards on the team. You're a Duncanville product. You won a state championship with the two Duncanville freshmen that are coming in. Take us through their game and how they're going to help this Texas program. Well, both of them are very good at what they do. Ariel was McDonald's All-American USA. I mean, she's just offensive minded. She can go score when she wants to. Tasia's very fast. I think she's going to trouble some people on defense. I mean, I think they're just two competitive freshmen that we have, and that's good for us. What's the biggest difference between this team and maybe the last couple? Well, I think the last couple of teams we had to get used to Coach Aston's system, and we, didn't, we wasn't quite sure what she wanted. But now that she have people who have been under her for two years plus, we know what she wants, we know what she's looking for, so we're able to help the freshmen out that is here now.